but this is a follow-up to our conversation about job costing and this has to do uh, with some of the technology we're using for estimating. I'm Brad Levitt, president of AFT Construction and welcome to our YouTube channel. So we just did a episode on job costing and the importance of understanding the pricing structures of your home and the database. Uh, and there's actually another software that we use that some of our, our contractors and followers asked us uh, about and that's called PlanSwift. And so PlanSwift is software that we use with um, our devices. You know, you can run it parallel with a Mac. It is PC based, so you can run with PC. And what it does, it allows us to take the plans, we can implement all the plans, and we do quick takeoffs. So for example, here in this home, we have a substantial amount of stone. And it's really important to do square footage takeoffs so we can quickly, through PlanSwift, go through, and our pre-construction estimating team can do the takeoffs and understand how much square footage is needed for all the stone throughout the house. We can do the same thing with the brick, so we can get some linear foot measurements. Um, we can put that into our database and really understand, okay, are we looking at $100,000 of stone and install? Are we looking at 150? Are we looking at 25,000, right? And it's really important from the beginning to have that cost basis, especially when you're looking at a rendering of a house. If you can get that to scale from the architect and put that in, in, um, in plan swift, you can quickly um, use that technology to understand a range for the stone. And of course, it'll vary depending on the actual selection they make, if it's real stone or veneer. You know, in this case, it's real stone. So it's pertinent for us as a builder, not only to understand project history and data, but also to reach out to some of the suppliers in town and get a good idea of what they're charging um, for our corners and for our field stone, um, because it does differ. And so that's something that we are doing. So again, Plan Swift, look at that. It's pretty easy to use. They have tutorials and it's a great asset to things we're doing on the front end side. Thank you so much for tuning in to our YouTube channel today. Please comment, like, and subscribe.